This is a conspiracy theory that argues that technologically viable, non-polluting, and no-cost energy sources are being suppressed by the government, corporations, or advocacy groups for economic, political, and social reasons. It is alleged that suppressed devices include perpetual motion machines, cold fusion generators, torus-based generators, reverse-engineered extraterrestrial technology, anti-gravity propulsion systems, and other generally unproven, low-cost energy sources. A number of government agencies, corporations, special interest groups, and fraudulent inventors are alleged to have been involved in the suppression of this invention since the mid-19th century. The alleged suppression is allegedly perpetrated by various government agencies, corporate powers, special interest groups, and fraudulent inventors. It is usually claimed that special interest groups are associated with the fossil fuel or nuclear industries, whose business model would be threatened. In modern science, it is evident that many free energy claims, such as the ability to extract zero-point energy, are impossible. According to conspiracy advocates, the scientific community has controlled and suppressed research into alternative avenues of energy generation through peer review institutions, as a result of its control and suppression of alternative energy technologies. Free energy devices or related efficiency technologies are also claimed to be suppressed by buying a patent from the inventor or his family, suing the inventor, or even murdering the inventor. In the 1930s, Thomas Henry Moray, a free energy researcher and public demonstrator, claimed that his lab was ransacked and threatened several times and he and his family were shot to stop his research and public demonstrations. These claims have not been supported by any evidence. Claims of suppression include It is alleged that peer review and academic pressure have been used by the scientific community to control and suppress research into alternative forms of energy generation. It is believed that there exist devices that are able to extract significant and usable power from pre-existing unconventional energy sources, such as the quantum vacuum zero-point energy, for little or no cost, but that these devices have been suppressed by the power industry. There is a claim that patents related to 100 miles per gallon carburetors have been bought up. As a matter of fact, Stanley Meyer, Eugene Maliv, and Nikola Tesla are some of the notable people who have claimed to have been suppressed, harassed, or killed for their research. Proponents of free energy claim that Tesla developed a system, the Wardenclyffe Tower, that could generate unlimited amounts of free energy. In spite of this, his system was only intended to transmit energy for free, the energy in the system would still need to come from conventional sources for the system to operate. Gary McKinnon, a Scottish computer hacker who unlawfully accessed computer systems in search of evidence of a secret free energy device, is one of the most prominent proponents of the conspiracy theory.